Welcome back to Tape Place. We're going to take on Airman. We are out. halfway done. I'm just saying. Look at all well, the We're halfway done with the first part of the game. There's a whole second part? Yeah, we have to go do the Wily Castle after this. Oh, uh, okay. Remember, yeah, this is my first stage. time. I... Yeah, Mega Man Virgin over here. <laughs> all right. I, I think I'm doing pretty good. Not too bad so far. Uh, next, for sure. Yeah, obviously Metal Blade. <laughs> well, off to a good start. Well, I get it now. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Little dildos pop up and just knock your ass off. Uh, wait. <laughs> oh, they don't count on the ricochet? No, they do not. <laughs> that would have been cool. All of the uh, all of all of the kinetic energy has been, you can make it over that. Go. Or not. I want to kill that guy. But now there's more of the guys. Just get out of there. I don't yeah, care. They, only, they the... only spawn dudes when you're on top of them. Don't, don't science me. That. Like all the kinetic. I'm still hitting them with a saw blade. <laughs> well, yeah, but I mean, if, it's, if all the inertia has been taken, it'll still hurt. Yeah, but it won't kill you. Yeah, but it, it could knock them out of the sky. Look, we're in the sky. Not if that wasn't a mechanical thing. What if they've got some sort of anti-gravity repulsor lift that's just there? Like I don't think a, they do. They don't have any propellers, so how else would they be flying? You pose a good question. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> <laughs> the lift has to be coming from somewhere. They don't have any propellers, which is the obvious choice. Don't jump. Don't jump. <laughs> <laughs> I fell for that like eight times. Not again. Um, you you wanted to hop on that. It'll come back around. Right? Well, well here we are. We'll just reset the screen. We'll just go hang out over here. Shoot these uh, repulsor lift guys. Did you ever watch the White Rabbit Project? Yeah. Is it good? Oh, yeah. Super good. I was talking about that with someone the other day about how uh, beeps are terrible for uh, letting you know, like, where something is. What is terrible? Beeps. Beeps? Beeping. Uh, and that white noise generators are actually much more functional. Because they did a really cool test on the White Rabbit Project where, like, Grant sets up a... Uh, Can't see the other one. There it is. Uh, sets up an uh, obstacle course. <laughs> because the whole thing they were trying to prove is that like beeps are omnidirectional. So okay. oh that was cool. <laughs> you have magic metal plays that disappear <laughs> eggs, apparently. Oh crap. So much help! No, no, more, no ammo. ammo. <laughs> there, there we go. go. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so the uh, the whole point was that beeps like if you if there's a truck backing up on like a construction site and it beeps, like you don't always know where it's coming from. Yeah, okay. So the test was, uh, they were testing beeps versus, like, the white noise generator, and they took Tori. I don't like this. This is, like, invisible all over again. I just have to run forward and trust that I'm not going to die. Yeah, you're fine. But yeah, so they put Tori in the center with a blindfold and a polycarbonate shield. And then Grant had, like, four guys next to speakers with a bunch of dodgeballs. I'm sure you can see where this is going. Uh, so he turns on some background noise that's like construction site noise. Do I just gotta jump and hope for the best? Uh, basically, you gotta get over to the edge of the platform. Like that. But that guy knocked me off. Right. Okay. So, Tori's in the center blindfolded. Damn it! And, uh... Grant would push a button, and then one of the speakers would beep, and that guy would throw a dodgeball at Tori. Okay. And he was supposed to try and block him. He got none of them when they were testing the beeps in the speakers. Uh, and then they switched to the white noise generator, which is like a... Uh, I don't really know how to describe like the sound the it makes. It kind of, but it's more like a... Mm, type okay. sound, like a buzz more than a beep. And uh, he, he blocked every single one of them. He looked like he had Jedi powers. <laughs> <laughs> so I wonder why... Like, what, what were they testing the pr that prompted that test? Uh, basically, first of all, things that beep suck. We've known that since the 80s. Since the uh, 80s, okay. Everybody hates them. Well, I mean, think about, like, your old alarm clock. Or yeah. 
every time you're about to die in Zelda. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but their whole point was that we need to get rid of things that beep because so many things beep that people don't even pay attention to them anymore. Huh. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know how I made that cloud. Who knows? But we did it. I'm so mad I have to do this level over again. Well, yeah, but now you got it. I hate this part. This is where I can't see shit. You're alright. There it is. That's, a, that's the one great thing about Mega Man is you're not timed. Right. Like, there's no time limit. Well, and it's like you said... In Which is them. extremely forward-thinking of them for the time. It's like you said. It's, like, it's a um, holdover from a bygone era with the arcade stuff. Yeah, exactly. And this one did a lot to do away with that. It still has limited lives. But you have unlimited continues. So you can start at the beginning of the level again. Mm -hmm. It has a password system, so you can get to where you left off. So, I mean, it's very forward-thinking in general. Uh, yeah, Zelda you, was I the guess, same way. I guess, yeah, because back then, like, you couldn't really do save states like you can here. No, uh, I believe Legend of Zelda was the first NES cartridge that had a save yeah. state, that had a backup battery. So and I remember, yeah, the battery would die, and then, like, your save was gone, and all that shit. Yeah, uncool. They used that for years. To be fair, those batteries were good for a really, really long time, though. <laughs> Especially in something that uses as little power as right. just, like, saving two you. bits of data. <laughs> You got this. Just relax. You're panicking. I'm not panicking. You're, you're a little panicking. I'm not panicking. You're panicking slightly. No. You're slightly panicking. No. It was just you the look, guy You're looking a little panicky. You, you're panicking. You're panicking at the disco. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Ah. Where's the boss? Where's this guy? It uh, that guy was a fan. Uh, not of yours. Oh, what? two lives! Boop, boop! Nice! That, make, that totally makes up for having to do the level again. Right? Okay. <laughs> Thank you, birdies. That was actually pretty awesome. Leave me alone, bud. Get bricked. Oh, God. Well, there's one. There's one life down. So I had a, I had a buddy. I guess I still have a buddy. I just haven't seen him in forever. Um, <laughs> but he has like a... He had like a... Switch to metal blade. He had like a speech impediment thing going on, right? And he couldn't say his R's. It came out as like, aw. Right? Aw. Aw. And, um... Like for you from New York? Uh, ish. <laughs> but, um... But, like, unintentional? It wasn't an accent? <laughs> right. And, um, there was this one time, we were at this party, and we were, like, he was super drunk, and we were, like, out on this guy's balcony at his apartment, and, um, this bird was chirping. Nice you didn't get hit by either of the things. Uh, I know, right? But this bird was chirping, right? And it was, like, one in the morning, and he was, like, having a yelling match with this bird <laughs> in his drunken state, and he was, like, go back to your nest, bird! But it's one in the morning. <laughs> Go back to your nest, and bud. We were like, Chance, why don't you just come inside? He's like, because this bird wants to fight me. <laughs> fight me in the street, bud. <laughs> come at me, squab what I'm, I'm ripped. <laughs> <laughs> the best. Uh, was that a... Oh, God, that, that scared me. Complete, that legit scared me. At a completely separate time, we were talking about... Um, Disney princesses or something like that. Oh, you just despawned that guy. I don't know how you did that. <laughs> uh, but he went to go say that his favorite princess was Princess Aurora. Aurora? Aurora. I love Princess Aurora. <laughs> Good for him. It was awesome. I missed that guy. <laughs> I think that's it. All right, so he's weak to Mega Buster. To Mega Buster, huh? Let's go to next. This one? Uh, no... Go back to next, scroll, and then hit, just hit start. No? This is my original. Yeah, there you go. My bad. Yeah, it's called... I don't know why it's called P. Photon. No. Yeah, apparently he takes double damage from the Mega Buster. But you can't hit him, so that's fun. Oh, yeah, but you're totally wrecking his face. Clean off. You're wrecking his face clean off. Oh, well, there you go. Take Face that, Airman. All right. Wow, he well, didn't like uh, that at all. No, he was not about the lemons. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, I love that those, those uh, yeah, those tornadoes are just your buddy now. Just hanging out? <laughs> well, shit, okay. Well, he killed the master, so... Now I don't know what to do. Nobody's <laughs> telling me. I guess I'll just hang here. Now I got air Get shooter. equipped with air shooter. 
<laughs> it's, just a, it's just a fan. I got another message from Dr. Light. <laughs> it's just a fan. <laughs> like one of those personal spritzy fans. <laughs> Hold on, if we're going to have a fight, can I borrow an outlet? I need to plug this in. Oh, man, and then, yeah, you beat the bubble guy. You go buy him so that it has the spritzy. <laughs> oh, that's nice. All right, I got equipped with item two now. Oh, shit. I don't even know what item one did. We'll try my... I forget... They became like the rush mechanics later on. Um, now who was weak to Airman? All right, next time on table plays, we're gonna figure out who's weak to Airman, uh, and we're gonna go there next. Yeah. So be sure to be check sure out to like, our, comment, subscribe. Check, check out, out the rest our of our videos. epic Heatman battle. So far, that's the level to watch. Yeah, definitely. It's uh, like four episodes worth of stuff to get through Heatman. Yeah, if you enjoy watching Saga get frustrated, that's definitely where you want to start. But anyways, thanks for joining us. Be sure to subscribe, and we'll catch you next time.